I want to uh, talk to you about the concept of uh, time. How much time did that cost? You know, we talk about how much money did that cost. Um, but what we really should be asking ourselves is how much time did that cost? You know, if we um, have a better income, um, you know, you get X amount of dollars per hour. Uh, the hour is the more valuable thing, not the money, right? So if we say, hey, I bought something, it cost me one hour. It cost me five hours. It cost me 27 days, you know, whatever it is. Um, and so that's, uh, that's a really valuable way to, of looking at it. And uh, you can modify what the hour is worth. You can modify your income, but you can't modify the time. Right? You can't modify the hours. All of us have so many hours in a day, in a week, in a lifetime, and that's it. That's all we get. So um, in the beginning of our career, we trade our time for money. And if we're successful, uh, we can trade our money for time. And uh, time is the, the more valuable uh, asset there. Um, if we buy something, and it requires maintenance or it requires our attention or it requires our care um, then we have to understand that you know we're going to have to invest time in that to own that right that that possession is going to cost us time so we have to think carefully about that you know if you uh buy a house plant or if you buy a puppy you know there's uh two completely different things <laughs> relative to time now, of course, you know, there's other considerations if you want it, if it gives you joy and, and happiness and all that. But possessions uh, also um, can, you know, do uh, take up more or less time. So we have to be careful not to be owned by what we own, right? Not to be possessed by our possessions. So um, how much time did that cost? It's a good question to ask. See you soon.